what's going on everybody Mike here with yet another video and today I kind of wanted to do kind of a new series that I wanted to start and it's just let's draw I'm nowhere near a artist it's just a hobby that I'm trying to learn so what better way to force myself to learn to draw than to start doing more videos about drawing but primarily today I wanted to focus on this and this is the bamboo smart stylus and it says for uh, Samsung products essentially for your notes and your tab A's but this is uh, the box, obviously. This is the pen. It's nothing more than a Wacom pen. It's got one single button on it. It's essentially a jumbo S Pen. So it does the exact same stuff as the S Pen. Nothing more, nothing less. It's just a little more ergonomic, so easier to hold on to. So I wanted to do another drawing on my uh, Tab A 10.1 and uh, so I could test this. So what I'm going to do is just do a time lapse of the drawing that I'm going to do and then I'll kind of tell you my thoughts of this like I said doing a uh, drawing with the actual S Pen it works great it's just that it's such a small pen that it kind of made my hand hurt after a while so I'm hoping I can remedy it with this and it'll just feel more ergonomic and comfortable to use so with that sit back enjoy a little bit of music and some time-lapse action all right so before I show you uh, some time-lapse drawings I wanted to give you a closer look at the actual Bamboo Smart Pen. As you can see, it comes with a little cap here. And essentially, you take it off. Now, older models, they had this cap. When you get it in the box, it would come on the back of it. But it was for decoration only. It actually wouldn't come off. I found that out <clears throat> the hard way one day. But anyway, it's got one single button right here on the side. And it just mimics what the S Pen does same functionality as the s pen so no different there but just for a comparison i wanted to show you uh, size wise this is essentially about the same size as the surface pen as far as um surface pen is a little bit fatter um, but as far as the length and everything it's fairly similar and to me it's just as comfortable to draw or write with and of course here we've got the s pen itself which is tiny in comparison so for long drawing or writing sessions, I definitely recommend this. The only complaint I had is the tip that comes on this is a little more slippery than one than the one that comes natively on the S Pen. So um, it doesn't quite have as much tooth is the word. But in the box, you get a total of three extra tips as well. And the tips that come with the S Pen actually fit in this. So if you want to give yourself a little more bite or tooth, you can take one of the tips that came with your S Pen and put it in the bamboo stylus and it works just fine. So, like I said, <clears throat> drawing with this, I got no complaints. It's much more comfortable. I've done a couple drawings with it and my daughter's actually used it as well and she agreed that it is uh, way better than the S Pen and fairly comfortable drawing. So, with that, sit back, enjoy some time lapse. And again, as always, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, please do so. Thank you. 